Hello, welcome to our Rinsing Academy. This is another session of Tricks and Techniques class. So are you ready to learn something new? Yeah, I hope so. You are ready to learn something new. Uh, and as I promise, today I am going to discuss to find cube roots of any number which is not a perfect cube. Right? So this is very exciting because most of you are not able to find cube roots quickly. So that is why here I am today to discuss how to find cube roots of any number which is not perfect cube. Whether it is a one digit number, two digit number or three digit number. Any kind of number, four, five, seven or whatever you know. Any kind of number is there. You can find the cube roots of that numbers. Approximate value very very close to that one up to two place of decimal seven because a perfect uh, cube, if it is not perfect cube, it can have two, three, four, five, six place of decimals. So, in general, we can find two place of decimals and which is very accurate. So, how can you find it? Uh, let me explain this today. So, first of all, I would like to say that you must remember the cubes of numbers. Several numbers and that is a general practice in which you can learn. This is say, one cube is one, 2q is 8, 3q is 27, 4q is 64, 5q is 125, 6q is 216, 7q is 343, 8q is 512, and 9q is 729, 10q is something like 1000, you know, 11q is 1331, and so on, etc. Some cubes of numbers you must remember so that you will be able to analyze this. Because this technique is basically based on this method where the numbers lie, in which region, which, which range the numbers lie. For example, if someone has supposed to find cube roots of 9, then what will be the answer? Cube roots of 9. Let us discuss this. Cube roots of 9 cube roots of 9. This number is more than 8 and less than 27. 9 lies in the range of 8 and 27. So cube roots of 9 must lie between 2 to 3. Cube root of 9 must lie between 2 to 3. It will be certainly more than 2 and less than 3. So first basic number I should write here 2. Now how much it is more than 8? 1. So I should write here 1, 2 plus 1 divided by a square of this number that is 4 multiplied by 3 every time. Means what I have to write in denominator always? In numerator I have to write the difference, difference of numbers and in denominator I have to write a square of this number multiplied by 3. That is thrice of a square of this number. So what will come? That will come 2 plus 1 by 12 is nothing else but 0 0.08 so answer is 2.08 will be the answer of this number cube root of 9 is 2.08 got it? I hope you got it this is very very accurate number up to 2 place of decimals and you can be able to analyze this right? so now let me discuss another number that is cube root of 25 this number is closer to 27, right? Who will select the closure number? Closure to 27, so 20, cube root of 27 is 3. Now 25 minus 27, always you have to subtract this reference number from this number. What I did here? 9, 8 is subtracted from 9, so positive 1. Now 27, 27 is subtracted from 25, so what will be that? minus 2 divided by a square of this number that is 9 and multiply by 3. Thrice of a square of this number that will come 3 minus 2 divided by 27 is what? 2 divided by 27? Will you tell me? 0 point if I put decimal then it will be 20 and this is 200. So almost 7, 2.07 so answer is 2.93. And therefore, some other examples I can take here. Let me write some other examples. Cube root of 60. 60 is what? Closure to 64. So I can take 
4 as a reference plus what is this? 64 this number is le more than less than 64 so it will be minus 4 difference is minus 4 right now difference is 60 minus 64 is minus 4 now a square of this number that is 16 and multiply by 3 4 4 just 16 and what is that 4 minus 1 by 12 1 by 12 only can be calculated that 4 minus 0 0.08 that is 3.92 and that will be answer so in similar situation we can deal a square root cube root of all numbers taking one at a time let us consider a cube root of a three digit number three digit number say 130 you know it is more than 125 so answer would be more than 5 5 plus 5 more a square of this number that is 25 multiplied by 3 that is 5 so again this is 5 plus 0 0.16 0 0.06 and that will be answer is 5.06 that will be answer of this question if I took another number say I am taking here 225 cube root of 225 then what is the approximate number closer to this number 216 so of course this will be 6 can be taken as reference and thereafter whether it is less than or more than more than how much more than? What? 216 and 225 now. So how much more? This is 9 more than the actual number. So I can write here 9. Now a square of this number 36 multiply by 3. Thrice of a square of this number always need to write 4, 6 plus 1 by 12 again and 1 by 12 you know that is 0 0.08. So 6 plus 0 0.08 that is 6.08 so any number of this category can be dealt with this trick and you can find this cube roots of any number which is not a perfect square i hope you got it if number is more closure number is more then the difference will be positive if the closure number is less then difference of that would be negative so i hope you got it and you will enjoy the trick and technique and find the answer of all such questions, whether in SSC or bank view or for any other examinations or even in usual practice. Thank you, thank you very much for watching. We will see you in the next class, next tricks and techniques that will be very helpful. Please subscribe our channel for regular update. Thank you, thank you very much.